trivia time! Wow. Wow. There's no trivia in this one. No, I'm just kidding. I'd be so upset. <laughs> <laughs> First no, question. No. Thailand holds the Guinness it? World Record for the I longest blank city name. Dragon. Noodle. Wait, oh, what? Beach. I think there's no way it's beach. City name? Because Dragon. Chile exists. Chile, yeah. That whole country is a beach. City Dragon? I don't it know. Might be, maybe city dragon. name. Well, no, there's Noodle? a really weird one in Europe that has a really long name, so maybe no, not. No, I think... I'm going to say Dragon. Dragon? Yeah, I'm going to say Dragon yeah. because... It's city name. It is city name? We're talking about the city of Bangkok, which boasts the full name of Krung Dep Manhan Khan Aman Ratana Kosen Mahantrara Ayataya Mada Haldilok Pop Napa. This is really long. Napa Ratan. Let Jacob try next. Nai Buraron Udemarachanet Wei Masa Hatan Amon Pimana Watan. Sati Sakaya Tatiya What's so Nick on part For us it translates to the city of angels Great city of immortals Magnificent city of the nine gems Seat of the king City of royal places Home of the gods incarnate uh -uh. Erected by Viskvakaram at Indra's behest They came up with all those names and couldn't decide That's what happened Jacob, I want you to try saying the whole thing. Um, I'll do it next. Excuse me? Like... Where was it? It starts here. Why, why was Wait. this city... Named? Wait, it starts here. Krung. Krung Tep Mahakan Aman Ratanas Kosin Mahatan Tara Ariyasthawa Maharadalik Fop Nabharit Ratshin Thani I'm gonna put a timer in the video. Rudamaracha Newit Mahathathan Aman Piman Awatan Satit Sakayatatia Witsanukam Prasit. I butchered that. It takes up <laughs> three lines of the paper, like yes. well, two technically if you drag that down. So Krankta Manakanaman the Ratanakase Mahantara Ayutaya Mahadalak Pop Nafarat Rachatani Buriram Udarna Chidamit Mahasatan Amon Pinman Awatan Sati Sakataya Wesakaman Prasit. Yep. That's a long name. Holy crap. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I don't think anyone's gonna top that anytime soon. <laughs> we'll do it. We'll discover a new city in Africa. Yeah, let's do it. Number two, which of the following is illegal in Thailand? Illegal? Yeah. A. Leaving the house without underwear. B. Driving without a shirt. C. Stepping on Thai currency. Or D. Insulting the king. I what? imagine insulting the king. How do you enforce the underwear one if that was it? I don't think it's that one. It's obviously the underwear one. The but shirt one makes sense. I was going to say, driving without a shirt is what I'm going to say. It's possible, though, that it's the king. Like, if they have a king. That's the thing. Do yeah. they have a king? That would be it. And if it is, a, if, and how playful is he? Is he open to it? <laughs> is he into it? Is he into it? <laughs> anyway, what's your guess? Um, Stepping on the currency is also very believable. Yeah, I'm gonna do that one. All of them. All of them are <laughs> All illegal. Of them. That's not fair. <laughs> It says it seems like I hate that they do that. Like part. every country has its share of weird laws, but while A and B will only get you a sixteen dollar fine, C and B are serious. How are they checking me for underwear? Thais adore their royal family, and doing anything to insult them could lock you away up to fifteen years. Since Thai money bears the face of the royal family, stepping on it's a big no no. What if like, you know how they drop coins though? Would I get shot for just like someone dropped their spare change and I was going down the sidewalk? <laughs> Uh, That's not fair. It was all of them. <laughs> Why are you sitting like way over there? Because I'm scared. You always do that, actually. You're always like out of frame. But then again, what? I don't have your end of the couch as in frame for some reason. Anyways, come closer. Come. Wait, wait, I don't want you guys to see the answer. I'm the trivia boss. Okay, fine. Spread out. Number Google. three. During the American Civil War, the you King of Thailand offered stuff. Abraham Lincoln blank to aid the war effort. A. A. Monkeys. It has to be monkeys. I B. To be monkeys. Elephants. C. Advice. Or D. Advice. M money. I think it might be elephants, actually. Monkeys. That one sounds more right. The elephants. It's calling me now. Because <laughs> they use. Because what was this for? The uh, civil war. It is for okay. Because they use 
elephants for war. So yeah, I imagine they'd be thinking the same thing. Elephants could be monkeys. Like monkey I, commandos would have been badass. That would have been sick. But I Abraham Lincoln elephants. said no. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna say monkeys. Elephants. What do you say? Advice or money? Or you can agree. Monkeys. You're gonna say monkeys. B. So is elephants. Yeah. During the Civil War, the King of Thailand sent the U.S. several gifts, including a sword, a picture of the royal family, two elephant tusks, and an offer of several elephants to be bred and used as a war effort. While most of the gifts were accepted, Lincoln had to reject the Thai king's generous You know how offer awesome that would have been for the Union to freaking have elephants? That would have been, uh, yeah. Probably could have, you know, maybe he didn't want to be too violent. You know, it was entirely his That would have changed, like, our entire military force, <laughs> though. I know, it's are you doing in my swamp? You forced me to look at the light. <laughs> Yo, what's up? Yeah, our recording space is his current living space, so we've just been invaded by Mexicans. <laughs> Straight out of LA. Straight out of LA. <laughs> Thailand has won the blank three years in a row. A, World Martial Arts Tournament. Uh, B, International Ooh, Snow Sculpture Competition. Snow Sculpture? Yeah. No. C, Global Rowing Competition. Oh, and D, International Sand Sculpting Sculpting. Gym. Maybe the C. sand? Wait, what was, the, what was C? A, Global it's C. Rowing Competition. Rowing? Rowing makes sense, actually. Um, I want to be the hand. I don't think it's the snow sculpting, gonna be honest. I said the sand. And he said rowing? I'm doing a? snow for the memes. What if it's A? Uh, but it is the snow. It really is the snow? <laughs> <No>? <laughs> it's the snow sculpting. Ah, uh, yeah, it's Thailand, land of tropical clients, what, <laughs> white sand beaches, and a three year winning streak in Japan's international snow sculpture competition. What? Despite Thailand being a tropical country, the last snow they saw was in 2005. <laughs> they managed to beat all the odds and remain the champs at the winter contest. In fact, what? they've won the competition nine times out of the 20 they participated. How do you win entirely out of your element? I don't know. <laughs> Number five. In Thailand, it's considered good luck to give two blank as a wedding gift. Pink orchids, elephants, bowls of rice, or Siamese cats. Siamese cats. Siamese I want get? the elephants, so it's probably like the orchids. It's probably the orchids, but bowls of rice, I like that. That's cool. I'm saying the orchids. It's cats. All right, let's see. It's the cats. Ooh. These majestic cats with guess. bright blue eyes originated in Thailand, which was one of the no which was once known as Siam. Did they eat them? Which is why they're Siamese. The unique cats were adored by royalty oh, who well, believed the animals carried the souls of those who had passed. Today, Siamese cats remain one of Thailand's most treasured species, thought to bring good fortune. So they don't eat them. Do you want to travel to Thailand so I can get married over there instead and get the cats? Yeah, yeah, it's true. Just get the cats. Uh, which of the following familiar foods originated in Thailand? Mm. Heinz ketchup, Red Bull, Gatorade, or Kikoman soy sauce? These are not. <laughs> these are not the options I expected no at all. No no Is it Kikomans? It's uh. It better not be like Gatorade. A. What was it A? Heinz. Heinz ketchup. Heinz. That's like. What would you say? Kick them out. Kick them out. That's like German. <laughs> I don't even have an answer for this one, to be honest. I'm gonna say A. Well, what's the answer? I'm gonna say it the Red Bull, I guess. It can't be the obvious answer, right? It actually it probably is Red Bull. It is Red Bull. Yeah. It is Red Bull. <laughs> and we thought Thailand's most famous drink was the iced tea. What? Uh, Wait, why, why would Thailand's be most famous, famous drink be the iced tea? Thai iced tea? Everyone it's straight up called Thai tea. Really? Yeah. yeah. I didn't know that. Um... Thailand's first developed an energy drink called Crating Dayong in the 1976 as a refreshment for rural, eat this crap. rural eat workers. It the unique drink inspired Austrian oh, dude, try this thing. Thing, blah 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 to create to a similar version to suit Western chip. taste. It has a really wild like half the flavor. The two men co-founded. It has half the caffeine as the original. These the original chips? had more. The Red Bull. Oh. <laughs> Just have gas. <laughs> Red Bull Company in Thailand, looking for a little extra zing. The original recipe with double caffeine can still be bought in Thailand today. And, the, and when the inevitable crash hits, Whoa, the they'll wind down with some yeah. Thai iced tea. This All dude's right. trying the lard. I don't like this. Misbe it's a weird assortment of flavors, right? Yeah. Tons of crap happening. Misbehaving Thai police officers are required to wear blank as punishment. <laughs> to wear. Okay. Uh, Pokemon hats. A red sticker. A pink bow. Or Hello Kitty armbands. I I'm saying the Hello Kitty armbands. Dang it! I was gonna say that. That's we well, can say it that's too. like so believable. Yeah, <laughs> it's got to be the armband or the bow. Uh oh, let's see. I'm gonna say A. Yeah, it's the kitty armband. Okay. 
All right, thanks a lot, Jacob. Ruining everything. You can just cut that out. Anyways, I'm I don't cut out anything. Out. I'm not talking to you. All right, so <laughs> we upload things raw, unfiltered. <laughs> Uh, if a police officer in Thailand parks illegally, arrives late to work, is caught littering, or they don't get a or uh, they don't get a slap on the wrist, they get a Hello Kitty on their bicep. Misbehaving cops have to wear pink heart-covered Hello Kitty armbands as uh, over their official uniform. That's like kind of drippy, though. Yeah, I know, right? It's kind of sick. It's the perfect punishment. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Stop by Bangkok restaurant with Tana Pani to taste their 45-year-old blank. Soup, coffee, tea, or pad thai. It's soup. Tea? It's soup. It is the soup? Good soup. Good mm. soup. It's uh, perfectly safe to eat. The Kawin Nun Tawang family uses an ancient practice called perpetual stew that uses leftover broth to start the next day's soup. Yeah, it's because it's always boiling so it never gets bacteria. Wow. With this method, they've had a pot of bubbling... Uh, a pot bubbling for almost half a century. Even okay. more amazing, there's no recipe. Each member of the family learns to make it by taste alone. By taste alone? That's the last of the trivia. Well, that was that was Thai trivia. Um, a lot of snacks still sitting out. Help me! Um, no. <laughs> but yeah, that was, that was a cool, fun one. I liked this. The trivia was pretty funny. I'm a little pissed that one of them was all the above. <laughs> why? Why didn't Abraham Lincoln take the elephants? That would have you been know sick. how badass it would have been. Like that our been military so cool. officially had elephants. He would have been like he, they Thailand offered war elephants for the Civil War. I think they would have just surrendered. He could have been like Hannibal, like, bro. Like, Dude, the second they sick. heard the it elephants, been sick. He could have he could have crossed the the Rockies in the dead of winter and flanked them just like Hannibal did <laughs> in the Punic Wars <laughs> with <laughs> elephants. With <laughs> <laughs> no wonder he was assassinated. Oh man. Shovel 606, it's gonna need some more treats. We gotta decide if they need only the heat. See you again soon. Next time, bring a spoon, put in the work, and then get dessert. Go ahead, come on over. We'll go and get some boba. Some that's fried, some that's green, some that's chilled. Oh dang, I think something spilled. Alright, waiter, pass the bill. It's.